Hello everyone, William here, and today I'm going to show you how to set up Unity for making mods for Unturned. So, first of all, I suggest you download Unity Hub. The first link in the description will be for downloading Unity Hub. You'll have to scroll down a little bit until you see these two buttons here. So, if you have a Windows, you're going to press this one. It will download an .exe file that you'll just have to run and you'll be all good to go. Next up, you will have Unity downloaded. It's going to offer you to download an editor, which is the latest version, which you do not want. Because it will not work for Unturned modding. So you will have to install one yourself and it won't be available in the hub itself and it will only show you the most recent versions. You'll have to go to the archive, which will be the second link in the description, and you'll have to go in the unity2021.x section and look for 2021.3.29. If you have the hub installed, you can just press unity hub and it should open up in the hub. Um, so you can just select this, make sure you have both Linux build mono and Mac build support as well. For master bundles, you don't need anything else. You can have Microsoft Visual Studio if you want. It's not required for anything. So this is an optional. So we're going to go ahead and press continue. Agree to the terms and install. And now it's going to install and I'll show you what to do right after that. So the editor finally finished downloading. So now we'll go ahead and create a project. So I'll hit in the project zone. We'll remove this one. Um, so we'll hit new project here. It should automatically select the correct version. If you have multiple versions of Unity, saved up make sure you hit that list and you'll see all of them make sure you select the correct one so we'll select 3d core it might select something from the learning category so make sure you go to all templates and then 3d core i'll disable the cloud connect call this youtube and i'll save this over here and you'll if you, you might have to select a Unity Cloud organization, I'll go ahead and do that. And then create project. Now we'll have to locate as well. Make sure to give it access. Um, you'll have to locate the um, unturned files. So pretty simple. Open up the file explorer. I keep it pinned for fast access. Um, you want to go in uh, on your disk right find where steam is installed by default showing program files 86 then you're going to go to steam apps and then common and then you'll see unturned right here and now you'll go for extras from the unturned folder and then sources and we'll need the two example packages here so we'll have to wait for you need to finish Loading up, which shouldn't take too long. So Unity finally open. Now we can import the packages. You can see there's a Unity icon next to the uh, file. So if you see that and it's, you all will double click on it, it open it. If it's not, that means you'll have to open it manually, click on assets and then import package and custom packages. And I'll have to navigate to this folder fastest way to do it is just copying and pasting. If you just click on this bar, this bar right here, copy and paste this. And when Unity will pop up this similar window to look for the files, you can just paste that and you'll be able to get to that folder really quickly. We'll import project first. So we can double click on that and then import. This is all the um, tools you'll need. It's pretty quick. We'll import that. I highly recommend importing the tools first, as we it's already done, and we'll go and import the example assets. Uh, you might have to re-import that every like couple months just to make sure that there's nothing new in them because they get updated every now and then. Make sure you have the most recent version. I'll import this. It might take from five to ten minutes depending on your computer, 
and I'll be back as soon as that's finished. So Unity just finally finished adding all the stuff in here. If we take a look, we should have all the examples here. We'll look in the object, for example, here in the buildings. We have this really cool tower. As you can see, it's got everything now. So you know the different models, the occlusion volume, and everything that you need. Um, you're going to have to find the bundle tools, which are located in Window. And then on Turn, you'll have the bundle and the master bundle tool. And if you want to use the custom unturned components, it's the same thing, component. And then on Turn, and you have all of them down here. Hope you found this very useful. Make sure to subscribe not to miss out anything else. And I'll see you guys in the next one.